Hello once again dudes, my name is Little Mel and welcome to a 12th XHTML tutorial. So in this tutorial I'm going to be working with something called text align. So what this basically is if I may explain. Text align is basically where do you want your text on the screen like. You know, here we have a blank page, this is the page of course. So we go ahead and print some text using text uh, tags and these are just you know printing out text and not keeping them paragraphs. So we're going to be like lol so if you refresh you can see that lol is right here so we can do something called text align and uh, let me mention this the align works on uh, paragraphs and everything you know um text like p and i and strong and small and sub and sub and all that stuff align works on it all yeah like p e i strong and sub and all this good stuff um, so it works on all everything so I'm gonna use P so if we say right alright so if we save this uh, I'm gonna reuse Google Chrome cause that's one I like the most and if we see and run it you can see it's now right um, if we put in single you know a little correction here and change it to left it will move over here um, but if we type in Sender. It will be here, and I can't remember if you can do this, but I think you can actually go ahead and type button. Oh no, that didn't work. That's not. Oh, that's enough for that. But yeah, you can type in left, right, and sender. So that's a way you can use um, text align. Uh, this is very useful. We're gonna be working with that later. Of course, you can always use send a command, uh, tags and stuff like that. But uh, again, this is a very useful command. And uh, if you, um, in the other tutorials, gonna get to, we're gonna be working with um, other languages. You'll see that with a very few commands, you can edit a lot of things on a lot of web pages using a language called CSS. But that's not this tutorial. Um, um, that's for the CSS and web design tutorial, but I thought I'd tell you a little bit about it. So, thanks for watching guys, hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next tutorial.